Let no more sins and sorrow grow, nor thorns infest the ground. He comes to make his blessings flow as far as the curse is found. Those words captured me many years ago, even as just a missionary boy. I began to understand that this curse of sin was far and wide, and that if the gospel was to go, it would need to go to the farthest and to the most extensive points of the earth. It is our desire, it is our vision, our passion to take the gospel of Jesus Christ, liberating these people from the bondages of sin by preaching to them the glorious light of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Preach Evangelistic Ministries works as a team to equip, send, and support the spread of the gospel to the unreached peoples of the world. This ministry exists to bring focus to the mission of God and call all believers to play their part in the fulfillment of the Great Commission. There are three words that help to summarize the vision uh, of our approach and our philosophy of ministry. Ethnolinguistic. We look at the world based upon language, and in doing so, out of these 7,099 living languages in the world today, we are able to see and pinpoint with a certain amount of specificness that we can, with some seven or eight different languages, reach a large block of the global population. Polycentric. Every church we start, every church we endeavor to plant, is to be its own center, its own Jerusalem, sending the gospel from its own company. So self-governing, self-supporting, and eventually even self-propagating. Organismic. We are not an organization, but we are an organism. Every man's been gifted by the Spirit of God, placed in the body of Christ with a specific gift. So we need one another. The whole entire team serves together, looking to labor toward God's purposes and God's plans and not our own. For the first time in my life, uh, as just a young boy, my parents took me to the mission field of Brazil. Uh, God used those early years of my life to give us the vision today that's nearly 40 years later, uh, but we see what God has done through this vision in giving us a ministry that is all-encompassing. Mentoring Men for Missions is a one-year intensive training program designed to equip families for the spiritual, physical, and psychological challenges of urban and rural third world mission fields. Theological Baptist Seminary is a two to four year Bible training school that prepares U.S. and foreign national pastors with biblical knowledge and pastoral leadership training. Tons of Truth is the translating, printing, and shipping facet of Preach Evangelistic Ministries literally tons of scripture and Christian literature across the world has been shipped and distributed to people hungry for the gospel. Bless International is the arm of preach that addresses the suffering, the sickness, and the many side effects of poverty, illiteracy, and abuse plaguing our fellow man. Can we say that our churches are in alignment with whatever God wants? Are we doing God's purpose? Are we doing God's will? Or are we simply in a promotion of self and a promotion of what we are willing and wishing to accomplish for recognition of men? Or are we here actually to promote the global purposes of God? The gospel is not being preached in many places simply due to the fact that we have no vision for those areas or because of the difficulty of the terrain or simply because there are not enough laborers to go. We, as a ministry, exist to be a catalyst for change in that. We want to stir, we want to motivate, we want to be the mobilizers behind uh, this purpose of getting the gospel to the farthest and most unreached places on planet Earth. Our plan, our desire, is that God would raise up multiple families, multiple men, to be a part of this vision. If God has given you a call, but that call is not to preach, perhaps there is a place, nonetheless, uh, where you can support and, and prop up the ministry in many, many different ways. We've heard for years, you're either a goer or you're a sender. I, I, I believe that everybody should be involved in going. We should be going some distance and we should be going somewhere. Uh, if, if only to those that speak our language, all around us, we should still be 
avid disciples of Jesus Christ. I love the words of David Livingston, sympathy is no substitute for action. I pray that if God is dealing with you in your life about a full-time commitment of service that you would allow him to accomplish in you his perfect and absolute will. We want to thank each and every one of you who have been part of our ministry for for over 25 years. Some have faithfully given, faithfully prayed and participated with us in many projects. And as the ministry continues to grow and expand, I know many of you will remain faithful at your post and we thank God for you and ask you to continue to help us further the gospel of Jesus Christ to the regions beyond for God's global glory.